thank you so much for joining us for yet another episode of our walking in freedom series ah, we are really excited to have you yes sir yes we are really excited i still insist mm-hmm. a notebook mm-hmm. a pen and a bible mm-hmm. be ready for more fire today yes. in thank jesus you. name amen so we are talking about freedom mm. and we shall go back to genesis mm. 27 verse 40 okay genesis 27 verse 40 the bible say by your sword mm-hmm. you shall live mm-hmm. and you shall serve your brother mm-hmm. and it shall come to pass when you become restless mm-hmm. that you shall break his yoke from your neck by your sword yes you shall live by your sword mm. see one one sign mm. of enslavement is living by your sword okay where you have to it's like you are always on the edge mm-hmm. financially it's by the sword mm. you are not freely mm-hmm. enjoying the blessings mm. that were freely given to us mm. you are always using mm. your own sword mm. i believe that as believers mm. we are, the bible says that it is not of him that will it mm. we are not supposed to live like a, for you to get a promotion mm. you, you you have to give someone a bribe oh, okay. for you to 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 get a, a good house you mm. have to sleep with someone mm. you know where 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 now it is your hand mm. Mm. I, i don't believe that is our portion mm. as believers and the bible says mm. that you will live like that mm. there will be restlessness in your pocket mm. there'll be restlessness in your hands mm. there'll be restlessness in your feet mm. there'll be restlessness in your stomach mm. there'll be restlessness in your body mm. there's restlessness in your business mm-hmm. it will remain like that mm. until there's restlessness mm. in your mind yes sir most people mm. who are enslaved mm. are only restless mm. on their bodies mm. on their outside mm, external. there's there's external restlessness mm. But the Bible is saying mm. you shall continue to be externally restless mm-hmm. until you are internally restless oh. because your internal restlessness mm. is your candidate mm. is your is your is your ticket mm. for freedom. Mm. Now today I want us to see something. Mm. Father I thank you for this discussion. Yes Lord. I thank you for the spirit of understanding. Thank you. Whoever is watching will understand clearly mm. what the spirit is saying yes, Lord. in Jesus name. Amen. I want us to go to the book of Revelation chapter 4 verse 1. You see after remaining in prison for so long there are things that we don't even believe mm. we are supposed to get. Okay. There are things that seem too far mm. for us. Mm. Even our prayers are small. Mm. Because you you see <laughs> you, you have been living in mm. a in a single room for too long mm. that anything to do with a mansion it is is too much it's too much <laughs> father just father just give me a one bedroom i'll be okay i'll be i'll be sorted <laughs> you know i've had people that say you know i don't want so much money mm. I, i just want something that mm. just to keep me going mm. because when you have when you have been in prison for too long mm. big things mm. are so far fetched for you mm. but do you remember what god told abraham mm-hmm. look at the stars, look at the stars. So shall your descendants be. Mm. Uh, God was telling Abraham, I want you to get the best mm. picture. Oh my god. Mm. But you see when when you're in prison, mm. big pictures are too big for you. Mm. Big ideas are mm. too big for you. Big prayers are too big for you. Yeah. You you just want God to help you mm. to get by. Yeah. Today I because because the Bible says you mm. shall know the truth. The truth. and as as fighters of this second liberation mm. 
we, we are not fighting to break your physical chains mm. we are fighting to break mental chains yes and so in the next few minutes we, we shall try to tell you something mm. and in the next episode mm. we shall try to tell you something, something again <laughs> and in the other episode we shall try to tell you something again yeah. when someone is in prison mm. and you pay for them mm. to be released mm. you have you have set them free mm. or rather they are free now mm. as a believer you are free mm. as a child of god mm. you are free yes you mm. are free but you are not free <laughs> because after you pay for someone who is in prison mm. they are free now mm. but they are not free mm. until they leave the prison <laughs> you understand what i'm saying yeah, until they get that information mm. and they go and tell the warden hey, wait wait mm. I, they have paid for me mm. i should not be here mm. so 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 that is why we need to be free mm. indeed indeed yeah that's the word. Be- because wow. we jesus mm. paid everything mm. we, we are not supposed to be in the prison mm. but you see we are not free mm. because we are still there yes so it is accessing that information mm. that hey jesus paid for this thing. Mm. this is how you should be doing now mm. now get out of the prison mm. and you know what when the warden when you go and tell the warden, hey they have paid for me mm. the warden cannot keep you inside anymore mm. you understand it is impossible yeah. when you produce the evidence look they they have paid for me you you cannot be kept inside again mm. it is impossible the truth makes you free mm. it makes you free indeed mm. i'd like us to address something mm. that is prevalent uh-huh. in people who are in prison mm. and that is the law expectation you you have been poor for so long that the idea of one day owning your own house it does not make sense it does not make sense <laughs> you have seen so many problems marital challenges in your families so the idea of you being married it, it does not make sense now you see it is this low expectations that keep us from this blessing the bible says mm-hmm. the expectation of the righteous mm. will not be cut short mm. but now we have a problem mm. because now the righteous mm. don't have expectations okay mm. they are not expecting anything mm. their expectations are too low mm. so you see um, your, your life mm-hmm. gravitates in the direction of your thoughts mm. whatever is happening inside mm. your heart is your center of gravity mm. is what determines what comes to you mm. is what determines what is coming out of you mm. so now because of people's poor expectations mm. they get very poor results mm. so now god looks at you mm. and he says the only way for you to be transformed is for your mind to be renewed mm. your prayers are too small mm. your expectations are too small mm. when you wake up in the morning mm-hmm. what do you expect to see on that day Do, do, do you expect anything mm. when you wake up in the morning mm. what do you expect to see that day you, you see now you have been getting small results during mm. the day mm. because when you woke up you are expecting mm. nothing okay. wow. so the only things that you yeah. get are surprises mm. you, you, you should not be living like that mm. when you wake up expect something Hallelujah. say like David this is the day that the Lord has made mm. I will rejoice and be glad mm. in it already you are saying that in this day I will have so much joy mm. I will have so much gladness mm. in this day have some expectation yes, sir. Is, it is not wrong for you to be rich mm. you have been you have been lacking so much mm. that it feels wrong for you to have money mm. revelation chapter 4 verse 1 the bible says after these things mm. I looked mm. and behold a door standing open in heaven mm-hmm. and the first voice which i heard was like a trumpet mm-hmm. speaking with me saying mm-hmm. come up here and i will show you the things which must take place after this come up here mm-hmm. i want to, i want to show you 
things but i cannot show you these things where you are wow. you see it is not that i don't want to show you these things but the the challenge is your location where where you are located these things cannot be seen you you where you are located mentally because most people think that the solution mm. is to move from one city to another mm. is to move from one business to another mm. no the the problem is not just your physical location mm. i'm addressing the place where you are located mentally mm. where you are located there mm. are things that you cannot see mm. there are things that you cannot expect yes, there are things that you cannot pray for mm. come up hither mm. upgrade the upgrade way upgrade some more upgrade <laughs> the way you perceive things mm. There are greater things that are in store for you mm. but you have been limited mm. by your mental location mm. am i saying something yes sir i'm saying something i want us to see something mm. go to revelation mm. chapter 4 verse 11 revelation chapter 4 verse 11 thou art worthy mm-hmm. O Lord to mm-hmm. receive glory and honor uh-huh. and power mm-hmm. for thou hast created all created? things all created things, all things all things yes sir uh-huh. and for thy pleasure uh-huh. they are and were created Listen, all things mm. were created mm. not for mm. when god was creating them mm. before he thought of you mm. he was creating them for his pleasure for his pleasure mm. pleasure god was creating trees mm-hmm. so that he can just look at them and feel happy <laughs> the rivers were to make god happy mm. to just make him feel pleasured mm. and now the bible says mm. that he created man mm. and put him in a garden called what eden eden, mm. eden means pleasure mm. so god created man mm-hmm. a god that loves pleasure, pleasure. Mm. created man mm. and put him Currents. in pleasure mm-hmm. and the bible says that he created man in his likeness mm. likeness can also mean mm. so that man can like what mm. god likes mm. i agree so that man can like pleasure mm. so when when you live in a beautiful house mm. and you feel Papa, pleasured by that house yeah, that man. makes you godly mm. when you wear a nice <laughs> suit and you feel nice about that suit yes, sir. that makes you godly <laughs> when you drive a nice car mm. and you feel pleasured in mm. that car that makes you like god mm. let me tell you that demon that has been telling you mm. that it is not right Caraba for you to be rich sopra. that it is not right for mm. you to have a happy marriage yes. that it is not right for you to wear mm. nice clothes that mm. demon is defeated mm. in the name, the of, name Jesus. of Jesus by the truth yes. you shall be set free yes. let me tell you something you were created sopra. by a pleasurable god mm. and he put you in a garden called mm. pleasure mm. and he put you to like the things mm. that he likes mm. may you like pleasure from today yes stop feeling guilty mm. for wearing something nice mm. Stop feeling guilty Caramba, for driving so a nice car. car. Stop feeling guilty Caramba, for living in a nice house. Caramba. Stop feeling guilty mm. when you are walking with your girlfriend mm. and you're like ah I think I think we should not walk with her during my friend. Ah, ah, ah. <laughs> not at night. During the day. During the day. And you are afraid you are like ah, I think when people see me with my girlfriend walk with her. Caramba, walk with so your good. wife. Walk with your children. Mm. Drive your nice car. Mm. the god that created you Caramba. listen cross coop mm. like is karaze listen mm-hmm. when god created man mm. he did not put him in the upper room to mm. receive the holy spirit mm. <laughs> he did not put him in a prayer center mm. he put him in a place called mm. pleasure mm. i want you to see the number one mm. interest of god for man mm. is for you to enjoy life mm. that demon that is telling mm. you not to enjoy life i break it right now in the, in the name, name of jesus. jesus i destroy that uh, that yes. idea mm. that argument i bind it in mm. the name of jesus name of and jesus. i scatter it away in the name of yes. jesus christ listen to me. you were created for pleasure mm. if god mm. being god mm-hmm. are you godly than god mm. are, are you can you say that i am more of god than you, say, yeah. you, you you are not spiritual than god mm. if god created physical things mm-hmm. physical mm. for his pleasure mm. what is wrong with you mm. gathering physical things mm. for your pleasure when you go back to your house today mm. decide to improve the deco of that house mm. make it pleasurable yes sir 
make it make make your house a place of pleasure yes sir you see there is a way rich people behave mm. there is a way they think they, they think when you open their mind mm. they feel like they own everything mm. do you remember the rich man mm. and lazarus mm-hmm. the rich man is not in his palace mm. he is in hell, hell. Uh. he's burning but he's still but saying uh, said, I, i want to sopra. send i want to send lazarus <laughs> the guy's mind Karabu this sopra. this tells you why this guy was rich <laughs> it was not because he was corrupt mm. Because some people, when they see someone rich, mm. ah, you have stolen money. Mm. Ah, that new car, I, I think you have stolen. No, mm. there, there is a way people mm. that attract money think mm. they are in charge. Mm. The guy is in hell, but he's still saying, ah, I think mm. I can send Lazarus. Mm. Change your mind. Change your mind. Desire to live a pleasurable life. Yes. Do you understand what I'm yes, saying? Yes, sir. Yeah. Mm. I believe we can serve God mm. and still live pleasurable yes life. and our children still enjoy life mm, yes in this world mm. may the lord make so you a blessing God. in this life yes father i pray for everyone that is connected right now mm. right now any idea that is keeping them poor mm. i attack it with the truth of the word of god yes and by the truth that they have received yes may that argument be brought down in the name of in jesus in the name of jesus i declare right now in the name of jesus christ yes anyone that is jobless yes anyone that is jobless yes may they go out yes. and get jobs yes may they go out and get jobs yes may they go go, go out and start businesses yes. may they go out and dominate the marketplace in the, in the mighty name of jesus christ listen to me i know someone that was jobless for three months mm. and they were telling me every day mm. i cannot get a job mm. there are no jobs there are no jobs ask them why there are no jobs all right one day i spoke to them mm. and they cried mm. because i was very candid mm. i told them you are the problem mm. your mind has to change mm. guess what happened mm. they left the house mm-hmm. That day when I spoke to them they left the house mm. they came back with a job wow they were being housed mm. now they live in their own place wow the same day after mm. months mm. what happened i attacked that mm. binding demon mm. that mindset mm. with a certain truth mm. let me tell you something whatever you are yes. nothing is impossible with you yes nothing is impossible with you mm. may god prosper you in business yes may god give you a life of pleasure yes right now may you start desiring Arabo pleasurable so. things yes may you start expecting pleasure yes may you start expecting clients yes may you start expecting a new business yes. may you start expecting an expansion yes a new market yes. in, the in the mighty name of jesus anyone in mark in, in in business right now mm. i pray for your business yes may you take over a new city yes may you take over a new town yes may you take over a new market yes in the mighty name of in jesus name christ of jesus. may clients be attracted to your business in the mighty name of jesus christ right now i i i i pray for everybody yes. that has grown up in poverty yes and your mind has been conditioned to think lack yes. right now in the mighty name of jesus christ yes. by the truth of the word of god yes. may you receive a renewal of mind yes by this truth by this truth by this truth may your mind be renewed in the mighty name of jesus christ you will not be poor yes You will not be poor. You will not be poor. You will not be poor. Karabasosa. You will not lack. You will not, you will not be of the masses of in men. The name of you Jesus. will not be a beggar you will not in be the a mighty beggar. name of Jesus. Yes. Lebasi atokrasi kadaba. I'm so excited about what is happening right now. Yes. People are being delivered right now. Jesus said in Luke 4:18, mm. the spirit is an is a the spirit of the Lord is upon me mm. and he has anointed me mm. to preach deliverance, deliverance. to mm. preach it mm. there is deliverance that is preached yes. by the truth of the mm. word of god there is deliverance that is preached mm. listen go back to our first episode mm. this episode soak in that truth mm. we are giving you bits by bits mm. bits because every day we want you to to have something to meditate on mm. bits by bits allow this truth to make you free in jesus name amen amen, amen.